I know it's a touchy subject, but I'm just saying, like, I, as somebody who grew up in daily trauma, some of the excuses that are made for kids during today's day and time. I do if agree a kid, with that. If, if it's a one-time thing or whatever, but if you sleep every day, most of my kids, like, if, if it's somebody that sleep every day, I'm communicating with the parent, like, hey, are they, and I'm not, I'm not like an evil teacher. Like, bro, if it's a kid that's falling asleep every day, then that's a reason to reach out to the parent and say, hey, is something going on? You know what I'm saying? Why is he falling asleep? But people fail to realize teachers, we have discernment. I know if a kid is asleep because he's lazy Listen, and he needs to stand up yeah. or if he got something going on and he's sleeping. And we know these kids, right? So, like, yes. I think yeah. people but you know, think everybody people, got an opinion about, about make, what right, teachers Because, listen, everybody if got I had a child come in who was just tired, I'd be mm-hmm. like, do not sleep in class. But let me write you a note. You can go sleep in right, the nurse. Right, 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 right. Listen, 25 minutes in the nurse's office and then you're awake all day is right, better right. than you sleeping for five minutes in 